Okay, this is not me being sexist because the girls are cleaning and the guys are all in the physics lab. It's a it's a thing of if it's all categorized, it's easy. Girls kitchen, guys physics lab, girls cleaning. Fuck, that was more. I should have just kept my mouth shut. Fuck my life right now. I am not sexist. Fuck's sake. Welcome, Goombas, to another episode of Dengarumpa. You're here with Goomba. This time we are continuing off where we left off last time in the Dengarumpa school mode. Now, last time we spent a lot of time with Sakura-chan, a little bit of time with Mukuro, and a little bit of time with Byakuya. So I'm really hoping this time to finish off the free time events with Sakura. I think we finished all her free time events, and now we get to spend our tickets with her. So we've got that, but then we've also got Byakuya and Mukuro to worry about. So hopefully things go well. I have no idea what's going to happen on these ticket events because I've never actually done this before, but I'm sure we'll figure it out. Okay, let's get started! Ah, uh, Celeste is looking at us. Let's just continue. Thrills, chills, oh, I love that the school mode is like a completely separate thing in the menu from this. Okay, everything's coming back to me. There's Sakura-chan. Uh, th today's the day off, right? Yeah, that's it. Today's the day off where we are not allowed to work, so, uh, we're not allowed to work. What would you like to do with Sakura? Use a trip ticket. Oh, this is cool. Where would you like to go? Oh my god, how much do I know about Sakura? So, if I had to go with Sakura-chan somewhere, where would I take her? Crap, mother's calling. Mother dearest calling. Must return call, mother dearest. I know I'm a lovely child, aren't I? Looking after Mother Dearest. Yeah, Mother Dearest. Unfortunately, today she was on the bus, uh, packed like sardines because it was on the bus that also ends up going to the beach. But she wasn't going to the beach, she was going to the medical center. And while on the bus, someone ripped open her handbag and stole the contents of the wallet. Who the fuck does that in Sydney? To a 60 year old woman. So she's just like gone to clear her head in a shopping center and I just and it's like really late so I'm like look just just call me when you're done and I'll drive you back so yeah that's that's kind of why she's calling okay where would I take uh Sakura -chan? that's kind of why I'm playing at the moment I it's late at night I, I wasn't supposed to record tonight I had to take the night off to just sort of chillax uh not a good week not a good week Okay, where would I take Sakura-chan if I was to take her somewhere? It's obviously not a date. You know, she's got a first love. We're, we're, we're mates now. Oh, this is a hard one. I honestly don't know. Uh, garden? No. I, I don't think so. I'm not a huge thing of nature. Music room, I don't play an instrument. Recreational room. I think I would go to the recreational room. Dining hall might be a little bit boring because it's just food. I know Sakura would love to get protein. Now that I think about it, I'm starting to think about the dining hall, nutrients, and food. Oh, I'm tempted. Dining hall! Here we are at the dining hall. This is the one place where we shall spend a lot of time together. Hmm, what to do? Is prote in really all that- What? Is prote in really all that great? What the hell does that even mean? What should we talk about? Well, you're definitely not gonna say that because you sound like a retard. Do you know how to cook? Yeah, let's just ask that. So in the end. Do I look like I don't? No, that's not what I meant. You're obviously like really good at cooking because... Okay, this is getting awkward very quickly. Part of my training is learning to be self-sufficient. I may look like this, but I am a good cook. I don't think this thing could have gone any worse than that. Crap. It looks like I'm totally horrible when I'm trying to be friends with someone. I am not good at being friends. 
Well, this is awkward. Sorry, but if you want some company next time, please ask some. <laughs> Fuck my life. I apologize. Oh my god, my heart hurts. My heart hurts. Wow, I, I can't be friends with people to save my life. Okay. I'm going back in time. That, that, that just, oh my god. Oh my god. That, um, okay. Okay, let, 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 let's try to go into Kuma mode that is not trying to be friends. Let's try to go into Kuma mode, who's hitting on girls, not trying to be friends with them. Okay, let's go into that Kuma. Okay, let's think of it this way. I spy with my little eye, Sakura-chan. If I was to take Sakura-chan on a date somewhere, to be romantic, where would I take her? A dining hall is not the most romantic place. School store, I'd have something interesting. But the rec room might be interesting. Let's go to the rec room. Okay, we've got a pool table. We've got darts. Okay, that's cool. We don't have a bar, but this is high school, so it's okay. Here we are at the rec room. There's all kinds of games and stuff to do here. Almost makes me feel like I'm not at school. It looks like nobody's here right now. What should we do? There's no shogi here. Do you want to play some pool? Would you like to play Othello? That's a good remark. There's no shogi here. I'm sure she would be good with strategy, right? Of course. You're right. They do have Othello, though. Okay, good. We didn't fail as much as last time. I prefer shogi to Othello, and I might not look like it, but I have a certain talent for chess, too. Okay, okay. Good, good, good. We got something here. However... Whether on the battlefield or on a tabletop, strategy plays a vital role in success. Yes? Okay, we can do this. Yep. I think we both had a pretty good time. You play chess, right? Or Othello. I can't play Othello. You guys know from my Danganronpa 2 Let's Play. Today was quite fun. If you feel the same way, there is no reason we can't do this again. So then. Well, we'd better head back. Oh my god, I got it right. So, me trying to be friends with someone um, ends miserably. Me trying to hit on someone goes quite well and we end up being friends. My god, I'm cursed. I'm the ultimate unlucky student. Monokuma. <clears throat> this is a school- Wait, he just read it. It is now officially night time. Get plenty of rest and get back to hard work tomorrow. Okay then. Sweet dreams, everyone. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. My god, I'm cursed with my skill. I don't even know if it's a skill. Mm. Day seven. Day eight. Oh yeah, we got a limit of 50 days. I might actually fail Let's this. Do it. Hey, 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 I feel like I could do anything. Leon seems to be feeling pretty good. Okay, so for the Monokuma Entertainment System, we need four more Pi calculators and one more microchip. Yes, I did the really annoying part of creating them, and I skipped it, but we just need to do a little bit more farming for materials. So let's see who we could set. Okay, Leon's really energetic, and he's really good at getting stuff. And we need a small light bulb, so we can send him there. Okay, Nike is full of energy. We could send him there. You're good at cleaning, so you're cleaning. Byakuya, I'll send you with Nike because you're like best buddies. You can clean. You can clean. You can clean. Okay, they're full of energy. Okay, let's send Sayaka and keep her the hell away from Nike. Like, that just ain't gonna work. Oh no, she's good at cleaning. This is not sexist. She's good at cleaning. And we can send Kirigiri with Byakuya and Naegi. Because, like, you know, we, we, we gotta put them together. And I'm not putting Aoi anywhere near Naegi. Because as we saw in the future arc, as soon as Kirigiri dies, she's gonna hit on that. So we're gonna send her to the physics lab. And Toko can clean. Sakura-chan can get us more materials. We might need an integrated circuit. Celeste can clean. And Mukuro is good at gathering. 
So I'm keeping her the hell away from Nike. Shotgun that. And send her here. Okay. Hopefully, hopefully this works. I hope. I hope. Hito, clean. Wait, I don't want him to get tired. Is there anyone else that's really tired? I don't want him to collapse. You know what? I'm gonna I'm put you to sleep. Okay. Uh, begin. Yes. I don't want anyone else working themselves to death. I keep screwing this up. I mean, last time I almost killed four people. I almost killed all the girls. That would be horrible in this school environment. Getting four girls killed. The ratio would just go completely bad. And the bad part is, oh, he was still alive. So, it'd be worse than that alternate ending to Danganronpa where Hiro and Naegi have babies with her. It, it would just be horrible. Okay, that was done. What would you like to do? Go meet with someone. Okay, well, if we go on another trip with Sakura, I'm guessing since we have trip tickets, there must be some sort of event, right? Like, there has to be. So let, let, let's just do it again. What would you like to do with Sakura? Use a trip ticket. Well, we already took her to the rec room. I think if we took her again, we might lose points. But let's just see, I don't know. Let, let's just test out the limits of this game. Here we are at the rec room. There's all kinds of games and stuff to do here. Almost makes it feel like I'm not in a school. It looks like nobody's here right now, what should we do? Kinda of boring here, huh? No. No, no, bad Makoto. You never say it's boring. Never, no. I'm not sure about any of these games. Okay, so... Both of these things are negative, and this is the only positive remark you have. So, let's just keep it positive. Well, I'm not sure I agree. Well, I fucked that one up, didn't I? However, I don't think a room like this is appropriate for a school campus. Okay? I get the feeling she didn't have much fun. Of course. I'm not sure that was the best use of my time. Okay, I need to go train for a while to get some energy back. So if you'll excuse me... <laughs> this game is brutal! <laughs> okay, so if you go to the same place twice, you fail miserably. You live and you learn. It's not cheating, I just don't want to waste trip tickets. I'm not grinding for them. Okay. We can't go to the rec room. Because obviously, you can't take it in the same spot. Music? Let's say music. If you're working out, you got to listen to some music. I listen to music when I work out by myself. When I'm with someone else, I'm usually talking and working out. I'm usually egging them on. Like, lift it. That dumbbell ain't going to lift itself. Reps for Chiaki. Alright, let's get to the music room. I don't play an instrument, though. Oh no, you got to play the piano. Wait, Sakura Chan might actually be able to play the piano, you never know. Here we are at the music room. But it feels less like a room and more like a full-on music hall. It looks like nobody's here right now, what should we do? I'm not a big fan of music. You're not saying that. I've always wanted to see some live music. Can you play any instruments? Question or remark, question or remark. Urgh! No pressure. Question. I'm sorry. No, I have no knowledge of musical instruments. Pastimes and hobbies in general are not part of my daily life. I get the feeling. This is. <laughs> Fuck my life right now. Of course. I am the worst <laughs> at dating Sakura. If you put a gun to my head and forced me to date her, I would fail miserably. Let's just take it to the school store, fuck it. We're going to the store, we're buying you, um, something. Here we are at the school store. Look at all this stuff, it's hard to imagine what they don't have in here. It looks like nobody's here right now, what should we do? Would that barrel be good for training? I really want this armor. Oh, it's some Monokuma merchandise. Okay, l let's mention the armor, she might be familiar with it, I mean, come on. You can cover yourself in armor, but if your own key components aren't strong enough, it won't help. Okay, good. Good. So in the end... You can put makeup on a pack mule that doesn't make it a lady. 
You have to train yourself first. Sakura Chan. Sakura Chan is. is. is really something. I get the feeling she did. Fuck, I can't even read her properly. Oh my god, I feel retarded. Of course. I'm not sure this was the best use of my time. I guess Sakura Chan has just been a dick. I have never said to a person in my life, I don't think this was the best use of my time. Jesus Christ, that hurts. Thrills, chills, <laughs> I mean, I'm sometimes brutally honest, but not that brutally honest. What would you like to do with Sakura? Wait, no shit, I accidentally went to the dining hall again. And if this turns out to be the right pick, I'm gonna lose my shit. What should we talk about? Do you know? Oh, it's just the same options. Is Prote really all that great? What? What are you talking about? Protein is supreme. Everything can be solved by adding a little more protein. So then. You should try adding more to your diet. I get the feeling she didn't have much. You know what? I'm getting a guide. Fuck this shit. What? Best location school store. That's a pretty cute doll. Would that barrel be good for training? Let's organize things in here a little. So, I should have just taken Sakura Chan to the store. I'm a fucking bad Kuma. I, I mean, hopefully I would be a little bit better with a character I would actually be interested in. I mean, Sakura Chan is senpai, but Mukuro, Jesus Christ. That's like, my god. Why am I hitting on Mukuro? That's bad. Okay. We'll go out with Mukaro after this, I promise. Here we are at the school store. Looks like no one else is here. Would that barrel be good for training? I see. Ah, well spotted, Makoto. That would indeed be quite useful for my weight training. But what's that doing in a school like this? Well, this place is so strange. However... Anyway, since you went out of your way to mention it, why don't we get to training? Could you help me with the barrel? It looks to me like she had a really good time. And she got a barrel out of it. <laughs> Thank you for everything today, Makoto. The time we spent together really means a lot to me. Perhaps. If you don't mind, could we do it again sometime? Yeah! I'd like to talk with you more. I think. Maybe. So then. Anyway, we should get going. Aw, she likes us. That's awesome. So that is how you succeed with Sakura-chan. Um, Play some chess and get her a barrel. <laughs> Rejoice, commoners, for today uh, I will show you just how far above you all I am. Byakuya seems to be feeling really good. And he's not his- oh well, he is technically still a dick, but... He's not that much of a dick. Where is he? You know what? Toko and Sayaka, without sounding sexist, you two are on permanent cleaning duty. Celeste, I'm putting you to find some shit for me. Find that shit for me. I really want that shit. All you girls, get that shit for me. You know what, Nike, you get that- Oh no you don't! If I put Nike there with all those girls, it's gonna turn into a harem. Fuck that shit. Nike, you're going to the physics lab by yourself. Fuck this shit. Oh, Byakuya, you go with Nike. And no doing creepy shit. And you give me that integrated circuit, Leon. I'm not putting you with the girls, fuck you. You gotta think you're a rock star or some shit. Okay, you two just keep cleaning. Uh, Hifumi, you clean too. Kiyotaka, I'm putting you... with Byakuya. No way, I'm putting you with Leon. Get me that shit. I need that shit right now. That's it, get to work. Work, peasants. Jesus Christ, Byakuya's actually working. My god, what happened? Seriously, look at him go. He's going for employee of the month here. He's absolutely nuts. And look at Mondo go. He's a cleaning machine. Did you get my shit? I hope so. You know what? Byakuya's been a good boy today. Let's spend some time with Byakuya. Alright, Byakuya, you've been really good today. I'll, I'll spend some time with you. What would you like to do? Spend some time. Well, no, wait. We did his free time events. Okay, let's spend a trip ticket with Byakuya. 
I, I, I think this is a pretty obvious choice. He, he spent the entire game in the friggin' library. Let's just take him there. Here we are at the library. It's pretty dusty. I've never seen a place so filled with books and other documents. It looks like nobody's here right now. What should we do? Just reading casually isn't enough, is it? What's your favorite kind of book? They even have textbooks here, huh? Oh, God. I, I, I'm worried that I'm going to fail miserably with Byakuya. I'm going to go with the first option. Hm. If you just skim over the surface of a source of information, it slides right off you. Once you truly put that information to use, only then does it become part of you. That's fine. I'm glad to see you understand that much. I hope you can prove it's not all you understand. It looks like to me... It looks to me like you had a really good time. Insulting the shit out of me. Though I, I, I do get his point. I, I really have to pay more attention when I read books. Which is why you should always... Like, you know, put like little things and go back when you need to. No, really, this book has nothing to do with romance. Fifty Shades of Grey is not about a romance. It's about a guy that's taking advantage of a very young, vulnerable girl that's never been in love before, and he indoctrinates her into his sex cult. Seriously, if you look at the step-by-step -step guide that cults use to indoctrinate people, and then you look at what Christian Grey is doing with Anastasia <laughs> they're pretty much the same but that's that's something completely separate we can probably talk with Toko about that <laughs> it's grown so late already <laughs> look how you've consumed my precious time perhaps it was too great of an honor for you well, I expect you to make the same effort to earn such an honor next time as well. He's got an odd way of saying, let's do this again sometime. Let's go. So then, let's go. My god, time is precious. Like, me taking a night off to play video games is a huge thing. This is a school announcement. Oh, seriously, I'd usually be training for three hours tonight. I'm only here because, like, my mom was pretty shooken up by the whole being robbed thing. Nah, no, she's fine. She's in a shopping center now. I'm just waiting for the call to pick her up. God, I'm adorable sometimes. Hell yeah! Oh god, Mondo. I guess I have no choice but to show you how freaking serious I can get. I'm scared. Mondo seems to be feeling really good. <laughs> oh my god, it's Monokuma. He wants another date. Isn't that wonderful? Cleaning Maestro. You're working your eager beaver butts off, huh? Let me give you something as a little reward. Well then, have a nice day. What is it? What was that? Sensubin! Ah, oh, it restores everyone's consciousness. Ah, oh, Leon's overworked. Fuck you, Leon. Raises cleaning by one level. Everyone's cleaning? Or just one person? Oh, one person. Ah, uh, who should I raise? Wait, who did I designate as a cleaner? Oh yeah, Sayaka. What the hell? Kirigiri's level 4 finding. And so is Aoi. And so is Mukuro. So is Leon. So is Byakuya. How come no one's level 4 cleaning, you lazy shits? Lift your game. I mean, y you can clearly see that Kirigiri and Aoi here and Byakuya are fighting for Naegi's love. Like, you can, you can see the comp... Oh, and so is Mukuro. Let's not count it out of the race. I don't know what the fuck Leon's doing, but... But you can clearly see they're fighting for his affection. Like, you can see that in this minigame... Well, it's not a minigame, it's like a post-game. Well, it is a minigame. They've already, like, more or less hinted as to Danganronpa 3. Like, look at it, it's right there. My god. Look at that. Holy shit. Alright, you're on permanent cleaning duty. I hate you. I'm giving you level 5. But I'm worried that if I put the people on yellow to work, they might get overexhausted. Like, I'm sort of worried about this. So maybe I can put half of them to work and put half of them to sleep just in case. Oh my god, Kirigiri is a princess. You go to sleep. I'm not risking overworking her. 
I know, I've developed a soft spot for her. Screw you guys. It's because I thought she died, alright? Fuck you. Okay, I really want that goddamn light bulb. You guys better get me that light bulb. Like, seriously. Do it. I hope they don't die after this. What? Leon, Kirigiri, and Celeste sleeping. Hmm. Celeste and Kirigiri, the only two girls who actually hit on during the Let's Play. Good! I needed those light bulbs. Get me more, that's it. Get me 12. Come on. Only 10? Lazy shits. In my feather to do a good job, I seem to have neglected my health. Yep, it's confirmed. If they're on yellow, don't put them to work. Who else? Only you? Good. Alright, since Byakuya was such a champ last time, we're gonna give him another shot. Let's spend some time with Byakuya. Wait, so what, what happens if we keep spending time? Does something unlock? Don't make me repeat myself. How many- Oh shit! Wait, what did I do? I didn't auto-press that. I didn't do that. How many times do I have to tell you? You're annoying. Feel free to crawl off and die. Oh wait, it's because I spent- All right. What the fuck just happened? Is it because I spent free time with him when, like, I didn't need to spend free time with him? I'm so confused. Alright, let's give this guy a radio. Bitches love radios. I see. Now, this is a rare moment. Oh my god, same crap. Come on, Byakuya. Oh god. This music. He's gonna ask me to kill someone for money, isn't he? Or worse. He might ask me to do other things for money. How do you still not understand? Understand what? Hmm. I've been sacrificing all this valuable time of mine for your sake. He's gonna kill us, isn't he? But it's all amounted to nothing. Huh? We simply have nothing to talk about. Huh? Not possible. We could talk forever and a day and I would gain nothing from it. But the more we come to understand each other, you and I will never understand each other. Okay, I'm gonna go out on the limb here and say he's getting all defensive to try to get us to ward away because he's never really had a friend like this in his life and he feels a little bit threatened and he thinks the best he can do is just try to ward us off. So, keep pushing, Nike, and if you get murdered, that is a risk I'm willing to take. We live in different worlds. Our ways of life, our ways of thinking are totally incompatible. You're a loser, so go ahead and live your loser life. Make a bunch of loser friends. Then together, you can lick each other's loser wounds. You don't have to keep saying loser. That's enough. Whether your self-indulgence is a lie or not, it doesn't matter. Whatever happens, I'm gonna keep on fighting, I'm gonna keep on winning. That's right. That's one thing that will never change. What the fuck is he fighting in here? He was on cleaning duty for three days in a row! But having to win all the time, doesn't that make your life kind of hard? Hmm. Such is the fate of the Chosen. Here we go! See what I mean? He was just warning us off, and now he's gonna give us the exposition of the inner workings of his mind. Come on, Byakuya. Teach me your philosophy. Teach me the ways of a successful... What are you again? Aflo Progeny. The Chosen. Listen, I've been meaning to ask you. Were you born from Minichlorians? Do you even have a father? You keep talking about the Chosen. What does that mean exactly? It means he has the highest Minichlorian count in the galaxy. He is destined to kill the Emperor and bring balance to the Force. Could you imagine Byakuya being the ultimate Jedi? Fuck my life. <laughs> the way you say it, it seems a lot heavier than how I'd normally think of it. That was a weird sound. That's fine. Fine, I'm going to waste my time with you anyway. I may as well explain this one last thing. No, it almost sounds like we're about to break up. I'll tell you how I became known as the ultimate affluent progeny. Oh shit. And with this music in the background, it sounds almost tragic. It's probably going to be tragic, isn't it? Son of a bitch. There's a story behind that. Nah, he was just born and given everything on a silver plate, wasn't he? 
So in other words, it has to do with the secret to the Takami family's prosperity. You're in porn, aren't you? Our success comes from our family's rather peculiar inheritance system. You killed your brothers, didn't you? Peculiar inheritance? What do you mean? Hmm. You see, our family had never takes a wife. Did they castrate you? Cuz... For the love of God! That would explain why you're always crossing your legs, but... Okay. Rather, he couples with exceptional women the world over in order to bear as many children as possible. This doesn't sound tragic. All over the world? What, are you going for like an achievement? Bang a girl in every continent? Or are you going for the Tagami factor? Bang a girl in every country? Or are you like really going hardcore and banging a girl in every city? Cause that's some Genghis Khan shit right there. Hmm. They then make the children complete and only one can come out on top. So... The head of the family has to have as many kids as possible and then out of all of them the most superior rules or do you end up killing each other or do you end up getting you know put into foster homes and forced to come out on top you know like they take all your money away and they want to see which one becomes the most successful within a certain time limit or set of conditions and then from that they see whether or not he's worthy to lead and whoever it is earns the right to become the next head of the family you mean you had to fight your own brothers and sisters that's right for my battle, there were 15 of us in total. When all was said and done, only one was still standing. The youngest brother, me. So the runts of the family ended up on top. Hey, Byakia, man, we could sort of relate. I mean, I didn't have any brothers or sisters, but I had cousins. And I was the youngest, weakest, fattest. I mean, the whole nine yards. And ironically enough, you know, you gotta help your family. The feels. <laughs> In the entire history of the Tsukami family, the youngest male had never won. Jeez, that sounds brutal. I can't even imagine something like that. What? So now, do you understand? Wait, did you have to fight them physically or... I won my title in open combat. That is how I became the ultimate affluent progeny. So you killed them. I was not born into greatness. I had to earn it. In other words, I put my life on the line, and I earned the right to be called the chosen. You put your life on the line, and then what about your siblings? Dead. Dead. Stop talking. I don't mean that literally, of course. They became dead to the family, unfit for the name of Togami. Oh, they got disowned. Thought you killed them. <laughs> of course, for them, it really is like death. They're forced to become one of the 99%. One of you. Ouch. But it must have been really hard, right? Hmm. You can't even imagine. Which is why the survivor is recognized as the chosen. When you take over as the head of the family, all the weight of the family comes to rest on your shoulders. So in other words... This is how dedicated I am. I am forever dedicated to keep on winning. And so I shall. Hm. Otherwise, I would feel only pity for those I'd already defeated. Byakuya pretty much said he carries the weight of always having to win. Winning comes natural to him. <laughs> all I'll say at this point is that I'm going to win this game too. It's been a long time since I've had so much fun. I need to get as much enjoyment out of it as possible. Don't make me repeat myself. And in the end, I will stand victorious. I won't lose to the mastermind, or you, or anyone else. Even as the rest of you fall one by one, I will win and I will win. In the name of my family. As long as my name is Byakuya Togami.
The finality of his statement left no room for doubt or question. Nobody but Byakuya could talk that way and sound so convincing. But because it's him, it seems possible that maybe that is his fate. Honestly, the more I talk to him, the more I see how far apart we are. At the same time, I feel like I understand him that much more. At least, I think I do. Goodbye. Now let me be crystal clear. We no longer have anything to talk about. Do not come to me like this again. Goodbye, loser. Well, fuck you too, Gary Oak. I can't imagine any way Byakuya and I could ever become friends in this lifetime. Funny how that works out, doesn't it? You two are just standing there, looking at a boat with a bunch of despairs on it. It fucking got shipped, literally. This whole fucking series is a giant meme. Like literally, Danganronpa has turned into a meme. A meme within a meme within a meme. And then Izuru's just standing there talking about memes. I mean, fuck it. 2016 and 17, the years of the memes. A frog got put into the White House. I mean, fucking United Airlines became a meme. Pepsi became a meme. Fucking everything's a meme. Even I'm becoming a meme. The maximum number of skill points has increased. Look at you go. Once Byakuya was gone, I went back to my room. And now Byakuya makes me feel like a lazy little shit. Thanks, Byakuya. You totally ruined me. He makes me feel like a little bitch. Seriously. Um, this is a school announcement. What, you want us to start killing people? Day 11. So... <laughs> Byakuya... I, I sort of understand him in that sense. I, I think I get it a little now. He's, n he's not a dick because he's just a dick. He's a little bit of a dick because he's got to be a dick. Like, you know what I mean? Like, you can't go through that shit without killing that part of yourself. Okay, this music doesn't fit. He gave me another spirit bomb. You're working your eager beaver butts off. Huh? Let me give you something as a little more. He gave me a freaking spirit bomb. Okay, this music doesn't fit at all. Let's wait till we get decent music, and then we'll talk about Byakuya. Kyoko's back to full power. So, I'm sending you to class. I, you know what? I'm sending everyone to class. Y y your education is important to me. Everyone get your ass to class. Begin, you lazy bastards. Well, I killed Kyotaka. Oh my god, half these people are sleeping. And, Sa and Sayaka and Celeste are cleaning. I feel bad for Sayaka, she's on permanent cleaning duty. Well that's what you get for messing up the entire room, Sayaka. Next time you bleed, don't bleed all over the place. Seriously. Yay! What would I like to do? Go meet with someone. Please no one dead, please no one dead, please no one dead, please no one dead. No one's dead! So, without time with Byakuya, I'm beginning to see him in a totally different light. I mean, it was a dick, but he's a dick because he has to be. You can't really, you know, compete with your siblings like that, have them disowned by your entire family and, you know, go back to Struggle Street without killing a certain part of yourself. I mean, the, the kid literally is forced to be a sociopath. He's got no choice in the matter. But he wasn't that bad in the anime. I mean, in the anime, he was a, he was a little cool, you know. I mean, in Danganronpa 2, he was he, he was pretty chill in Danganronpa 2, because he just kind of went with Nagi and Kirigiri. He's like, you know what? I'm going with you guys on this. Like, I know it's dangerous. I know I'm risking my life. I'm doing it to stop Junko, but like, I'm sort of also doing it because you two bastards are here. So he was pretty cool. And then in Danganronpa 3 with his helicopters. But still, I, I'm still questioning about him being on the cargo helicopter going up against... Yeah, nah. Okay, Byakuya, tell me more. I need to know more. Teach me the ways. Okay, I think that's it. Let's go use a trip ticket on him. And let's take him to the library. I mean, that's an obvious choice. I mean, what does he like that isn't a book? Probably doesn't even like girls. Imagine that, though. I gotta go and have plenty of kids, and then the kids are gonna kill each other. Figuratively. What does that remind me of? Uh-huh, it's pretty dusty, isn't it? 
Looks like no one's here right now. What should we do? Wait. Did I already use a ticket on him? Mm. Do I do this again? Hm. What? He's giving me the same thing as last time. That's fine. Why is it the same thing? Hm. It's grown so late already. <laughs> Look how you've consumed my precious time. Perhaps it was too great of an honor for you. Well, I expect you to make the same effort to earn such an honor next time as well. Let's go. So then, let's go. Wait, didn't this happen last time? I, I am so confused. I, I, I am so confused. Why did we have the same thing as we did last time? Oh my god, the place is filthy. Oh, days left. So we've got a certain number of days left before the thing gets done. Ah, oh, okay. Damn it, Kiyotaka. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Okay, Sayaka, you've been cleaning your butt off. I'll let you sleep. Celeste, keep doing your thing. Okay, everyone, get your asses in school. I'm, I'm, I'm Ben Cyril right now. Everyone, school now. Except, oh crap. We need more cleaning though. In the interest of not being sexist, I'm gonna have to risk this, but, uh. Wait, he's full of energy. Go clean. You go clean too. You're full of energy. I, I almost forgot. Okay, we've got enough cleaners. And Leon, you collect things. Because you're a four at collecting. We're, we're going to make sure we have people... We don't have people that are full of energy. Thingy. Begin, you bastards. That's it. You're all in class. Learn shit. That's right. Use that mining picking class. Let's see what happens if we spend more time with Byaku. I'm so confused. He, g he gave me the same library thing as he did last time. I'm taking him to the library. And if he gives me the same dialogue, I'm going to be WTFing. Here we're at the library. It's pretty dusty. Same dialogue. Looks like no one's here. What should we do? Just reading casually isn't enough. Uh, maybe I should try something else. They even have textbooks. I see. You're right. A quick glance tells me they've collected a wide variety of subjects. <laughs> Still, it doesn't quite stack up to what the Takami Corporation has access to. I think we both had a pretty good time. <laughs> I suppose there are worse fates than spending some idle time on your worthless invitations. Frankly, I didn't think you would ever convince me of that. Let's see if you can do the same thing next time. Ah, he's warming up. Let's go. Well then, we should head back. He is warming up to us. This is freaking adorable. This is adorable. By the end of it, he's going to be calling us a fwand. Okay, Monokuma. So today's the day, huh? I guess I better review everything one more time. The concept was Monokuma Entertainment System, right? But I already built it. I built it. Already built. I own it. Hey, um... It's like... It, it's not even a bear anymore. Oh my god, it, it looks like a Furby. What's this? This thing is supposed to keep me entertained? Okay, let's see what happens. Switch it on, and... My life is a travesty. <laughs> Monokuma's fucking... Oh my god. <laughs> Pet me. Pet me, 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 pet me. Shut up! Monokuma wound up and smashed the abomination as hard as he could. Sweet release! Looks like the MES is blasting off again. Man, that thing really cheesed my bananas. I couldn't stop myself from smashing it. Cheese your bananas? I, I really gotta learn how to swear without swearing. I'm sure I didn't even have to say it, but do it over! It's a total failure, but you did technically finish your assignment, you so I guess do? I'll give you some more tickets. You received eight trip tickets. Sweet! So the next concept is... Cooking Mama Kuma. Really? Really, bruh? Oh my god, I didn't get anyone killed. Sayaka back on cleaning duty. Okay, it looks like everyone's going to the kitchen. And that is not sexist. This is like the one game where I can put all the girls in the kitchen and not be called sexist. I love it. And I'm putting all the guys in the library. 
because they need education. Knowledge. Monda, you're a guy. Stop being so good at cleaning. For fuck's sake. We're separating the boys and the girls because thingo. You too, you're a guy. Get your ass in there. So are you. Get in there. You're a guy too. Get your ass in there. That's it. And Kiyotaka still collapsed. Son of a bitch. Oh no. Kyogiri and Mike. Oh no. You're gonna collapse. Get your ass down. Celeste, you better not collapse. I swear to God. Oh, uh, I might have to risk it with Kirigiri. I might have to risk it. Just this one time. Just this one time. Oh shit. Yeah, I'm gonna have to risk it. Three cleaners. Alright, let's do it. Work. Work. And the girls are in the kitchen. I'm gonna get so much shit for this, aren't I? Oh my god, this is more sexist than I thought. The girls are in the kitchen, the guys are getting an education to get a good job. Fuck, this was more sexist than I ever could have imagined. I was unintentionally sexist. Wait, partially sexist intentionally. I don't know how it works. Oh my god, no one collapsed, thank fuck. 756 monochroma coins. At one point, I'm gonna have to start spending all these. Shall we spend more time with Byakuya? Or maybe... Senpai. It would only be fair if we spend more time with Senpai. Come on, Senpai! What would you like to do with Sakura-chan? Spend a ticket. Let's take it to the store again, she might find something cool. Here we are at the school store. Look at all this stuff, it's hard to imagine what they don't have here. Looks like no one's here right now, what should we do? Ah, uh, ah, uh, let's dig for some treasure. <laughs> You're like a child. Just a little bit. Uh, but sometimes it's nice to revisit your childhood. I suppose I'll join you. I think we've both had a pretty good time. Hell yeah. <laughs> Today was quite fun. If you feel the same way, there's no reason we can't do this again. So then. Well, we'd better head back. Sakura really does have like a playful side to her. She's awesome. I like her. Not in that way, you dirty bastard. Um, this, oh. What? She's not my type. <gasps> no! Yes, indeed. Today's your weekly day off, but the place is a mess, Monokuma. Now then. Okay, dismissed. But the place is a mess. Uh-oh. So stinky. It seriously stinks rank in here. You okay, you guys, time for a little spring cleaning. Uh-oh. What? But I thought this was the day off. Wait. Why is Toko the only one on her knees? What the fuck is going on? No, I didn't mean to like... Wait, but aren't they all gonna collapse? Oh fuck, they're all gonna collapse. Wait, but I thought today was the day off. Um, what the oh, hell just happened? Oh god, a bunch of people are gonna collapse, aren't they? Hey there. Oh shit. Don't know why, but I'm feeling totally pumped. Oh yeah, I totally forgot about you, Mukuro. Awkward. Shunko seems to be feeling really good. I just had a weird thought in my head and I'm scared. Okay, I might as well say it. If Naigi and Mukuro got together and they were, you know, doing the thing that rabbits do. And one scenario where Mukuro is still pretending to be Junko and another scenario where Naigi knows that she's Mukuro. Wouldn't it be weird for Naigi to be screaming Junko or saying Junko's name when yeah, wouldn't Mukuro feel weird if he was calling a Junko in bed? Or what would happen if Nagi accidentally said, oh, Junko, when he's with Mukuro, that he knows it's Mukuro. So we've got these two scenarios. One where how would Mukuro feel Nagi saying Junko while she's keeping him a secret? Or when she's come out and said, hey, I'm Mukuro, and he accidentally says Junko in bed. What would happen? Why am I discussing this? Okay, fine, this is weird. Let's not, let's not... I don't know, I, did I describe that? Yeah, I described that really poorly, but... You get what I mean, right? 
Really weird scenarios. Why did that come to my head? I'm a weird person. Okay, this is not me being sexist because the girls are cleaning and the guys are all in the physics lab. It's a- it's a thing of- if it's all categorized, it's easy. Girls kitchen, guys physics lab, girls cleaning. Fuck, that was more I should have just kept my mouth shut. Fuck my life right now. I am not sexist! Fuck's sake. And Mukuro's on fucking crack. Look at her go. Oh, senpai. Please, senpai, teach me more about martial arts, please. I took the day off from training. Make me feel like a bad boy. I feel so bad now for taking a night off training. I guess I'm gonna have to work out shortly after this, aren't I? I'm going to have to. It's mostly because I switched my sleep cycle from waking up really late in the morning to waking up at about 6, 7 a.m. and starting an early morning. So I have to go to sleep like before 11 in order to get my sleep cycle done. It's really hard, but I'm trying to discipline myself. It's not going well. I'm not used to it. I'm really not used to it, but I'm being a lot more productive. Okay. Senpai. Senpai. Ooh, look. Monokuma merchandise. Huh? I don't like looking at it. Could we maybe cover it up with something? What? Seriously? No! Okay, so maybe going to the store again and again and again may not work. So, let, let, let's take it somewhere else. Dining hall worked last time, didn't it? Or maybe it didn't. No way, it didn't work. Shit. Okay, let's see if we can wiggle our way out of this one. Dining hall. Uh... Hmm, no one here. Do you drink much coffee? Yes, she does. So, are you and Hina like... No! Bad. No, wait. Good. Let's just ask. Fuck it. Hina. I'm not sure what you're thinking, but Hina is the first real friend I've ever had. Perhaps. I'm sure this is a silly question, but you're not having any Hifumi-like delusions, are you? No. Oh my god, I love these mistakes. Sometimes making these mistakes is like the greatest thing ever. Hmm, do you drink much coffee? Ah, a fellow coffee lover, eh? Yep. So then. Since we're here, why don't I make you a nice cup of protein coffee? Okay, I actually took her advice and put protein in coffee. It was horrible. I think we both had a pretty good time. It was horrible. It was... I put, no, I put coffee in my protein shake after a workout. It was horrible. If you feel the same way, we should do this so again. Bad. It was horrible. Don't try. You know what? Just fucking try it. I'm not your dad. Fucking do it. Fucking, like, I'm, th that's the type of parent I'm going to be. Oh. Like, the little shit's going to be like, but dad, I want to do this. And I'm like, all right, you little shit. You don't want to listen to me? Fucking fine. Hey put protein. Don't know why, but I'm feeling really pumped today. Two days in a row, I'm huh, a God, you're hot. Ah, uh, fine, 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 Mukuro, fine. Like, fine, I'll spend time with you. I don't even usually like blondes. Maybe because she's a soldier. I don't know, probably. Oh my god, I managed to survive the working task without exhausting anyone. I'm getting better at this. Fine, you've been so energetic. You've been a good girl, I'll go out with you. Jesus. What would you like to do with Junko? It's Mukuro for f Come on, Nagi. Get your shit together. She loves you. Or maybe she's obsessed with you. It's weird and shit. I don't mind hanging out. But you better keep me entertained. You've just literally been bugging me two days in a row to go out with you. And you're like, you better keep me entertained. Playing hard to get ain't gonna work now, honey. I spent some time with Junko, but... But what? Juke and I grow a little closer. But what, Naegi? What's the problem? Would you like to give her a present? Definitely. What would you like to give her? Do we have an AK or something? Maybe some brown brown. Brown brown? What is it? The mixture of cocaine and gunpowder. They give it to the young boys before they do battle. They do anything. 
don't know. I don't think we have cocaine here, do we? Uh, what can we give her? It was at this moment I realized that I'm running out of gifts and I'm gonna have to go to the Monokuma thing. I have to literally give her water at this point. For real? This is just for me? I... Why does her shocked face make me blush? Like, she's so... It, her face right now is like I just said the most unbelievably retarded thing that has ever been said. And she's shocked. But the shock is not coming from what I said. She's sh legitimately shocked that I gifted her a bottle of water. I, I, I am gobsmacked right now. <laughs> Let me give you a little peck on the cheek to say thanks. My god. I get the impression that she liked it a lot. That's good. No, you dumb shit. She likes you, not the goddamn bottle of water. God damn it. This is bad. God, I am seriously freaking bored. You're kidding me now, right? I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die from being so bored. What? Bad, 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 uh, bad. I, I'm infected. I've got terminal boredom disease. Is she serious right now? It, is it really that bad? Aww. I just hate being bored. Hate it. Yeah. I never noticed how much I hate it. But once we got trapped in here, it finally hit me. That's pretty recent. Are you for real? I'd rather be living homeless in the street than stuck in here. Homeless? Totally. Yeah, you know, like the hobo life. I've done it before, you know. What the fuck? You have? Yeah. Yeah, it's a long story. Awkward moment with Mukuro starts actually having an interesting personality. And now you're a model. Hmm. Well, that's a long story too. You're starting to become one of the most interesting characters in this entire series. Please go on. How many long stories do you have? But more important. Seriously, if I had to choose between staying here and being homeless again, give me the street. Uh, I, I guess I can understand that. I mean, you're probably in more danger here than there. How are you talking oh, about? hell nah! Homeless is totally dangerous. You never know when a pack of wild animals might show up. Where the fuck were you homeless? The forest? I love how she's so mad. She's freaking adorable. I've got issues. Wild animals? What? Oh, I don't mean literally. I mean people who attack the weak. Who want to hurt you. And my mother just got robbed today on a freaking bus. In Australia. In Sydney. Tell me about it. The world's full of animals like that, you know? But I think having to live like that made me way stronger. Hearing someone with actual experience like that really has a lot of weight to it. It's a weird thing. You would think that... I mean, obviously... I'm well off at the moment. You know, I've got a roof over my head. I've got food in the fridge. I'm not unemployed. I'm good. But... It's surprisingly liberating... When you sort of lose everything my experience would probably be when I left home sort of got kicked out of home sort of had to really leave otherwise shit would go down long story <coughs> oh fuck me <laughs> I'm okay oh you're good uh, yeah really long story let's skip it but the most liberating thing about it was that it made everything really simple. It went, it went from there's all these problems, all these complications to, okay, let's keep it simple. I got to prioritize on A, having food, B, having a roof above my head. So you go from, okay, my priority is having a big cushy bed and a big room and a good PC to, I need a roof over my head. I don't really give a shit if the bed's good, you know, sort of thing. And then you go from there. 
you know? You get like a small studio and then, you know, you start working up from there from, okay, I've got the roof on my head, I've got money for food, what else do I need? And then you start worrying about the creature comforts. But at the start, the priority goes to, I need food, I need shelter, you know? And then you really see that everything else is just filler, you know? You, you sort of stop caring about the unnecessary crap because you really see what's important in life. Food, water, shelter, safety, you know, security. Not the fucking chair. Though the chair is fucking unbelievably comfortable, but, you know. And so you stop complaining about all those other things, you know, like this this lamp uh, doesn't color coordinate with, you know, this bedside table or this bedside thing doesn't color coordinate with the brown thing behind me. You know, you stop giving a shit about that because that, that that's retarded. It's inconsequential, you know, it, it's not important. Unless you're going for the American Psycho look, where everything's got to be black, white, and grey. You know? Where was I going with this? But yeah, it's really liberating. If I can quote Fight Club, it's only when we've lost everything that we can truly do anything. And I felt in that moment in my life where I literally had to struggle for a time to keep a roof above my head, I felt the most liberated because I had the most choice. I wasn't tied down by parents, family, the problems at home, the struggles at home, the issues at home. It was just sort of me, myself and I. And I had to figure out where to go from there. And so it became survival rather than fighting for creature comforts and trying to make the family home as nice as possible. So that was one of the most valuable experiences in my life. It really was. And even if I had to choose, I would do it all over again. Because it was in that time frame of I'd say 6-12 months that I grew the most. I went from being a university student that worked two days a week and studied four days a week to being a university student that went to university three days a week and worked four days a week. You know what I mean? So... It was a struggle. But I grew so much as a result. And it... And you got used to it, and then as soon as you didn't have to struggle, everything else felt easy. Sort of thing. Though Mukita probably blows it out of the water, I mean, she joined freaking Fenrir. I mean, I didn't exactly join a mercenary organization. That's really impressive. I actually want to hear her story. Fuck my story. Let's hear Mukura's story. But more important. Sorry, that got kind of weird, huh? All I was trying to say is, no, 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 it didn't get weird. When the hell are go... When the hell are we gonna get out of here? Hey. hey, whatever dumb bastard trapped us in here. Are you listening? Where are you gonna let us out? Just tell us what we're gonna do to get out of here. Hell, you can even just tell me. I know how to keep a secret. What the hell is this? Nothing, huh? Pisses me off. Well, I mean, there's no way they'd make it that easy. But listen, you're not thinking of doing anything drastic, are you? Drastic? Oh, you mean the whole kill someone thing? <laughs> ah, don't worry, I can never kill someone. Let me tell you why that's bullshit. <gasps> what, do I look like I would? Do I seriously look like a killer? Well, you don't, but I know you are. No, that's not what I meant, really, you don't. For real? Right, I don't, right? But anyway, are you seriously saying you're worried about me? Gotta say, Makoto, that's kind of cute. That is adorable. You almost killed me with cuteness there. <laughs> that is freaking adorable. Huh? <laughs> Come on, I'm just screwing with you. 
You didn't take it seriously, did you? Yeah, behind every joke is a little bit of truth. But you know, there's something about you. I don't get sick of talking to you, like I do most people. Let's hang out again sometimes, okay? <laughs> there was something playful about the way Junko walked away. She was probably like skipping like a little girl or twirling her ass around. You know, like boing, 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 boing. I still don't get her. Am I getting played somehow? You've got no idea. Jungo's report art has been updated. You unlock the skill Trance. Give yourself a pat on the back, you earned it. Well, that was interesting. After parting ways with Junko, I went back to my room. What just happened? Um, this is a school. I'm okay. Then. Oh my god, the same thing again. Day 17. What happened now? Isn't You're working your eager butts off, huh? Let me give you a reward. See ya. What's the reward? Let's take a look at the reward. Lunch milk. Restore a little bit of HP. Sensubin! Spirit bomb. I don't need this yet. Okay, guys. I really want that freaking Bunsen burner. I'm serious. Give me that Bunsen burner. Come on, guys. Like, I sent you all there. That's it. More. No, the Bunsen burner. No, the goddamn Bunsen burner. God fucking damn it. Kirigiri, help me out of here. Oh, for fuck's sake. You're kidding me, right? You're kidding. You're kidding. I just need the Bunsen burner. And you literally gave me everything else. Fuck my life right now. Alright, Byakuya. Time to spend more time with you. Tell me more, please. Let's spend a ticket. No, wait! I accidentally... Whoops. Uh, let's see if they've got coffee. He's probably a coffee lover, right? Here we are at the dining hall. There is no one here. What should we do? He doesn't like burgers. Probably not. For breakfast, Japanese style is best. Sure. Come on. Where does such a standard of judgment come from? Certainly you're not saying that just because you're Japanese, are you? Hm. An empty statement inspired by pitiful microscopic worldview. I get the feeling you didn't have much fun. He looks insulted. Jesus Christ. Damn it, Byakuya. Imagine being married to him. Oh wait, you can't. I still don't know what Toko sees in him. It's Jesus Christ. Alright, let's go to the library. The only place where, like, you're happy with your life. It's still dusty. Maybe I should send someone to clean it. I wonder if they have any of Toko's books here. Oh god! Let's try it. The mere thought of my gaze meeting one of her books is enough to make my skin crawl. <laughs> oh my god! Pyakuya, I love you. Oh my god, Pyakuya. I never thought you would make me laugh. I can't believe Pyakuya made me laugh. He cracked the joke. Pyakuya cracked the joke. Ah, oh, crap. I keep accidentally clicking stupid shit. Wait, I'm the stupid one. Want something to drink, kind sir? <laughs> well, how considerate of you. Oh my god, that made him happy. I'll have a coffee then. Drip brew only. How about just instant, you dick? Naturally. Make sure it's chivet coffee. I accept no substitutes. I gave that to you as your first gift, you bastard. That's a pretty tall order. Looks to me like you had a really good time. And so did you, serving him. Hmm. It's grown so late already. <laughs> Look how you consumed my precious time. Perhaps it was too great of an honor for you. Well, I expect you to make the same effort to earn such an honor next time as well. Let's go. Day 18. Is it just me or the days getting shorter and shorter? I feel as if... I feel like I'm not my usual self. Perhaps because I travel to a parallel world to re-energize. Fumi seems to be feeling really good. Well then maybe you can get me a goddamn Bunsen burner, you son of a bitch! God damn it, I need another Bunsen burner for fuck's sake! Who do I have to kill for a goddamn Bunsen burner? Seriously, guys. I sent all you fuckers to the goddamn lab. Kirigiri, for fuck's sake. 
I'm even sending Hina there. For fuck's sake. You, get your ass to cleaning. Oh, you need sleep, Sayaka. Yeah, sure, you go to sleep. Fuck you. Alright. Oh, you need sleep too. Anyone else needs... Oh, fucking... S fuck's sake. No, get your ass in there. Okay. Literally, guys. I'm, I, I'm literally sending you all there. I need a goddamn Bunsen burner. Seriously, guys. Please. I'm serious right now. Get me a Bunsen burner. Thank fuck. Watch. Bunsen burner is going to have the least. They're going to give me everything else. Fuck you all. I needed, like, another one last time. Now you just give me five. This game is rigged. Why is this mini game so much fun? Like, the gameplay mechanic is literally... Like, I, I don't even know what to compare it to. Okay, Bjarke Dick, let's see where we're going with this. Let's spend more trip tickets. I cannot believe going to the dining hall actually worked. Hmm. Imagine taking him to the garden. I... I... He'll probably try to weaponize that plant. Here we are at the garden. There's all sorts of plants growing under the fake blue sky. I don't recognize most of them. Looks like no one's here right now. What should we do? Something seems off. The happy blue sky cheers me up. I'd love to just lay down and go sleep. I can't help myself. I don't have time. Did you bring me here to make me listen to your empty daydreams? It was foolish of me to think you could do anything other than waste my time. Oh my god. Okay, well, I, I was expecting some sort of funny thing, but I, I guess Byakuya bis, uh, pissed off is not exactly funny. I know what you're thinking. When are you gonna go talk to Kirigiri? Maybe later. Alright, let's take him to a date to the music room. Maybe we have classical music or something. Wait, I'm actually curious, because he hasn't been to a concert. I want to do some karaoke. I love to hear Sayaka sing sometime. Oh my god, this I want to hear. He's probably going to bag the shit out of her. Such ignorance. Whatever. Even the most famous pop song is forgotten within a year. Mindless drivel. He's got a point there, though. Well, that wasn't as brutal as I thought. He didn't attack her directly. He just attacked everyone that sings. Wait, what the fuck does that say about my Let's Plays? Fuck my life. What are you into these days? Bad question. I want to watch TV. Bad. You remind me of Sakura in a way. Let's see how this goes. Stop talking. What's that supposed to mean? Is that supposed to be funny? Sorry, but your mere existence is already enough of a joke. This is not going well. Okay, let's take him to the school store. Maybe we can find, like, an ancient artifact of some sort here that will spice his interest. He keeps saying he never had time for this, so... What's a lantern doing here? No. Let's dig for treasure. Oh god. That's a pretty cute doll. Oh god. Oh god. Um. Um, that's a cute doll? <laughs> it's an actual antique. Oh my god, that was actually the right answer. It's actually quite tasteful. Oh my god, he doesn't hate something. That's fine. But I never imagined such a unique item would catch your eye. You may be in need of a slight re-evaluation. I think we both had a good time. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I suppose there are worse fates than spending some idle time on your worthless invitations. Frankly, I didn't think you ever convinced me of that. Let's see if you can do the same thing Let's next go. time. I guess that went well. Day 19. <laughs> oh my god, Kirigiri. Speak of the devil and she doth appear. We talked about not spending time with her. Guess who appears in front of us? It's important that we do our best no matter what the goal is. There is just so much purple. Kyoko seems to be feeling really good. I keep calling her Kirigiri and not Kyoko. Should I call her Kyoko or Kirigiri? It's kind of weird. Why do I call some characters by their last names and others by their first names? It's, it's really weird. Why am I being so formal with her? Oh god, it's Monokuma. Nonsense, Subin, because we don't want to get sued. See ya. There are a few question marks. I don't like question marks. 
Let's figure out what's in the garden. And we'll probably find Hiro's weed. It it's gonna happen. He's, he's got weed in there. We know it. Smoke weed every day. Oh, Sayaka, you're full of energy. Now get back to cleaning. Oh my god, Mukuro's out of energy. How'd that happen? Okay, everyone, get your butts to work. That's it. Hiro, you're in charge of um, teaching them how to make hydroponics. Yeah, that's right. Wait. If there's ultimates, wouldn't they like be an ultimate drug dealer or something? Or is that for you, Hiko? Because drugs aren't that popular in Japan. Venus flytrap. Jesus Christ. Uh-oh. I'm feeling really out of whack. It might be a good idea for me to get some rest. Wait, did I just kill Makoto? I mean, seriously? I seriously can't do this anymore. I quit. Fuck you! You can't quit, you're fired. I don't have even enough energy to loaf around. I'm gonna lay down in my room for a while. Whoops. Well, I fucked that one up, didn't I? I forgot that I was actually Makoto. So today's the day, girl. I better review everything one more time. The concept was cooking Mamakuma, right? Yes, it's already built. Hey, what is this? Now. Aren't you guys all underage? I don't get- Oh yeah, he's got a champagne bottle. It's true. Drinking is absolutely out of the question. If I find out you've been hitting the sauce, total devastation. Of course. You better believe this one's rejected. Rejected, rejected, rejected! It's a total failure, but you did technically finish your assignment, so I guess I'll give you some more tickets. I've got more tickets than free time. Next concept is... Moe Moe Kuma. You're kidding, right? I feel like I could jump in the ocean and swim around the entire coast of Japan. Yeah, it's heavily radiated. Let's not do that. Hina seems really good. I mean, seems to be feeling really good. That was awkward. You're working your butts off. Here you go. More cleaning. I see. Guess who's getting a cleaning upgrade? That's right, Sayaka. You're my cleaner. Enjoy. I am being such a bitch to Sayaka. I am a terrible, terrible Kuma. Well, this ended gloriously. Ah. Uh, I guess this is why we have one of these, right? Where's my sensu bean? How do I sensu bean? Lunch milk. Restore HP, right? Get your ass up. Get your ass up. Problem solved. Well, I guess we can't ri- Seriously? Tree branch. You can get me my goddamn branch, but you can get me a Venus flytrap. Okay, we're gonna put everyone to work on the marijuana garden until we get this thing. And I'm not risking these guys being exhausted. Hero was exhausted from smoking weed all day. And look at Sayaka go. She's still full of energy. And always full of energy. Kirigiri is slowly dying. Ugh. I know we're kind of risking it, but we can send them. I wonder who's going to hit rank 5, Toko or Celeste? I never really took Celeste for the cleaning type, but we never know. What? HB effect 3. Hey, maybe I need to learn this. 3. 3. Oh, he's on 1. Yeah, but the HP category, they're on yellow. And yellow isn't when you collapse, because Nagi collapsed from yellow. Right? Oh, wait. I'm, I'm so confused as to how this HP works. Who, who gives a crap? Who gives a crap? Just begin. Work your asses off. I love that the five of them are just sleeping. And Sayaka's, like, doing nothing except cleaning. I feel bad for her. No, wait. No, I don't. Why does Toka clean on the knees? I don't get it. Why is she the only one that does that? Tree branch. Well, I got one I wanted, I guess. We started with Senpai. We must finish Senpai. 
That fucking sounded bad. What should we talk about? Of course. Anything is fine. But put some thought into it. Alright, oh, you don't like meaningless conversations. That's good. I have no topics to offer personally. But I don't mind listening if you have something you want to say. I think we both had a pretty good time. That's cool, we can enjoy each other's company without any ulterior motive. Today was quite fun. If you feel the same way, there's no reason we can't so do this again. Well, we'd better head back. Awesome sauce! Senpai likes us. Oh, crap! I should have looked at Monokuma. Monokuma tells oh, me how much then. people like us, right? So we can compare. <gasps> day 21. Oh, no. Yes, Today is your weekly day off. Now, okay, dismissed. We get one day a week off. Sweet. Go meet with someone. Monokuma, show us how much everyone likes us. I want to see how much Senpai likes me. Hello, Mr. Monokuma. Now then. Oh, you want to know how you're doing with everyone? Okay, let's take a look. Oh! Wait. Are you sure everyone doesn't actually hate you? Wait, Byakuya likes us more than Senpai? Are you serious? Are you serious right now? And why does Byakuya look so happy? This is ridiculous. This is bad. And Mukura doesn't like us at all? This is just horrible. Well? Hmm. Are you unhappy with the results? Well, if you want people to like you better, why don't you use a trip ticket to show a buddy a good time? You know what I'm saying? You gotta curry that flavor. I mean, favor. My god! We gotta spend so much time with Senpai. Spend more time on Senpai. With Senpai. On sen Saying on Senpai sounds like we're grinding. Not in that way, you bastards. Wait, no wait, I'm thinking of it that way. You kind of remind- I'm interested- You have no- We have no personal relationships. I've never met him before coming here. You certainly have a vivid imagination, don't you? Oh, okay. Well, that didn't end well. I mean, what did I really expect? You know, like, Byaku's being a jerk and all, and that's kind of all we see. I'd like to train with you. Oh, you're welcome to join me. Of course, I'll train you alongside Hina. If there's something you'd like to focus on, just let me know. I'll design a special regimen for you. Uh, why do you look nervous? Well, I might die, but I said I would be honored if I could train with you. So please. It looks to me like she had a really good time. Senpai had a good time. <laughs> Thank you for everything today, Makoto. The time we spent together really means a lot to me. If you don't mind, can we do it again sometime? I'd like to talk with you more. I think, so maybe. Bad. Anyway, we should get going. I still can't believe Byakuya likes this more than Sakura. This is nuts. So, if we just spend time normally, that doesn't count, right? Let me just check now. Sakura-chan should be the same as Byakuya now, right? Yup. Yeah. So it elevates. So we've got like another... Well, that's a heart, right? So four hearts on Byakuya, four hearts on Sakura-chan. And I'm guessing you need... ten hearts, right? Right? Are you unhappy with the results? If you want people to like you better, why don't you use a trip ticket? Alright, so if it's 10 per... Wow, that's a lot of trip tickets. We'll get to you eventually, I know you're gonna get pissed. But we'll bake you a cake. I'll give you a fax machine. <laughs> I still can't believe she likes the fax machine. <laughs> What's going on? It looks like Byakuya's lost in thought. So dull. Huh? That voice. Could it be? Are those Byakuya's inner thoughts? What the fuck? Oh my god, that music! Wait, what the fuck? That's... That's from... Makoto is an exceedingly dull boy. What the fuck? From everything he's told me, from the exceptions he set for himself. This is from Degoropa 2! I've not a single... I've, I have not a single shared interest in him. Huh? That is clear to me now. Wait, 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 he doesn't even comprehend that he and I live in different worlds. Uh, negation! No, it's wrong. 
Yeah! I think. I, what just happened? Right now, we're on the same level. We're in the same place, standing face to face. What are you, writing a fucking song? Stop talking. Hmm. What do you know? Swinging your immature metaphysical theories around like you're someone. You need to recognize your limitations. I don't think things could have gone any worse like that. Crap! Did I just fuck up? Such ignorance. I never want to see your face again, understand? Huh. I, I, I don't know what just happened. Um, okay. Was that good or bad? I, I have to try that again. I, I what, what? Why is the Danganronpa 2 music in Danganronpa 1? Like, this music was never played in the actual game itself. What the hell? What the hell? And what was that event? Does that trigger at five hearts? Here we are at the library. It's pretty dusty. And then, what the hell? That event randomly triggered. What the hell was that? Should we spend some time studying? I'll say I love reading. I'm the same, I won't deny it. But the distance between what you and I read is greater than the distance between the sun and the moon. Naturally. And I don't just mean what type of books we read. There is some information in this world that only a privileged few have access to. Criminal records for one, and uh, but I've said too much. It looks to me like you had a really good time. Okay, I, I, it's grown so late. So wait, what? I, I, Let's go. What the hell was that thing? That was some. Am I crazy? That that was some dang and romper two shit. That just randomly triggered. What what the hell, Monokuma? Explain this shit. Show me how much everyone likes me. <gasps> no! Sakura Chun's hearts are going down. What the hell? This is horrible, it's going down. So Byaku is on five, Sakura's on four. What the hell? Well? My god, why is it going down? I didn't do this. Byakuya, for fuck's sake. So we should have only spent time with Byakuya? Wait, what the hell? I just threw Sakura-chan away, I feel horrible. Why does Sakura-chan feel lonely now that I spent time with- Oh yeah, I spent time with Byakuya two times in a row. We should spend some time studying. You think I need to study? I mean, if I did- Oh my god. Let's see if it's possible if we max out a person to get their hearts Okay, he's on five. A uh, five. Let let let's see if we max him out to ten. What happens? I I I'm because it's literally impossible to get all these people on ten. Oops, I accidentally took him to the coffee place. What's going on? Byaku looks lost. Oh my god, it's happening again. So dull. <gasps> that voice. Could it be? Are these Byakus in the thoughts? Oh my god. Oh my god. Trigger happy heart. Okay. Okay. Let, uh, here we go. Makoto is an exceedingly dull boy. From everything he's told me. From the exceptions he's set for himself. Expectations he's set for himself. I have not a single shred of interest in him. Oh my god. This is clear to me now. He and I live in different worlds! Affirmation? Yaku doesn't look happy with that. I have no idea what's happening right now. You and I do live in different worlds, it's true. Naturally. Why are you telling me what I already know? Are you nervous standing before me like this? No, nothing like that, but so much of the time I don't understand the, the things you say. Such ignorance. Why should you? It's impossible for a commoner to understand the inner workings of a noble. It shows a certain wisdom for you to recognize that you can never call yourself my equal. If you see yourself as having a tragic life, then you'll never rise above others. Do you have what it takes to climb over them? Looks to me like you had a really good time. It's grown so late. What the fuck was that? 
That was weird. I, I just found out apparently these, um, your levels, your cleaning levels and your gathering levels carry over. So the first playthrough you do of school mode is the most difficult. And then everything else becomes easier. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. So I'm guessing in that case that we don't really have to worry about any of the tasks. We just more or less just have to worry about maxing out our levels. Which we're kind of going to do anyway, so... Yeah. I don't know. Well, Sayak is like level 7 cleaning. Please no one die. They're all in the music room. Go, go, go. What? 14 music... 17. Holy crap. Okay, I'm guessing Byaka's heart should be on 6, right? 6, right? And Sakura-chan 3. Why is this happening again? Why are you and Byakia in each other's thoughts? Nagi, if you turn gay on me, I'm telling Kirigiri. See, I called it Kirigiri again. I, what the hell? I have no idea. Why is this happening? Why why can Naigi read Byakuya's thoughts? Why they're connecting on a spiritual level? Why? I do not understand this. Why do you do this to me? These two are weird. I'm scared. Hell yeah. Oh my god, his rape face. Monda's feeling good. I'm glad that he hasn't died. I'm sick of this. It's no use, I'm all out of energy. I think one more donut would finish the job, but Ah, we here we almost killed our way. Yeah. Mr. Monokuma, show me what's going on. Byakuya should be on seven. He's on seven. And Sakura's well? still on three. So how did I lose points with Sakura? I was on four with Sakura. How did I lose points with Sakura? What did I do? What did I do? I didn't do anything. Let me guess. They're gonna connect again on a spiritual. Swear to God, Naegi. What the fuck? And if Byakuya turns out to be gay, I'm, I'm, I'm just gobsmacked. Do you know how to cook? He's gonna fucking kill me. Not possible. What are you talking about? Food is prepared by a chef. That's how this works. <laughs> Fuck my life. <laughs> that is the best response ever. Food is prepared by a chef. <laughs> Fuck my life. That that is a classic Byakuya. Food is prepared by a chef. Cars are driven by chauffeurs. I was gonna say something about a prostitute, but no. Let's take him to the rec room. Fuck my life. He's never probably thrown a dart in his life. Here you are in the ring. <laughs> Byakuya, Jesus Christ. Let's play some pool. <laughs> oh, I didn't expect you to suggest that. I must admit, I'm surprised you have any idea how to play. Yeah, he probably likes it because you use angles and strategy. <laughs> so what shall we play? One pocket, bank pool, or just the trick shot showdown? Dick. It looks to me like you had a really good time. I'm surprised Byakuya is really good at pool. I'm honestly surprised. I never thought he'd have time for pool. I never took Byakuya for the type. And don't tell me that his hearts went down. I'm going to be pissed. If his hearts went down, I'm going to be pissed. Okay, Byakuya better be on seven. If I lost points for taking him to pool, I'm going to be pissed. What? He's on eight. Holy crap. Well? It's happening again. Guys, please stop connecting. It's it, it's creepy. It, it's really scaring the shit out of me. I don't understand what the point of this is. 
Is this to show that they're friends or something? I don't know about you, but I don't read my friends' minds. I'm not Sayaka. It, it's some creepy shit. It, it is some creepy, creepy shit. 25. We're almost halfway through. <laughs> Rejoice, comers, for today I'll show you just how above you all I am. Well, he's probably happy. Okay, so I just completed the final thing with Byak here, and nothing happened. I'm guessing he's on 10 hearts okay. now, right? I'm gonna double check. Day 26. He should be on 10 hearts. Oh my god. No, 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 no. I know what I ha 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 have to do, and I'm gonna do whatever it takes. No, Toko. No, 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 that's not how you get my. No, 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 for fuck's sake. No. Toko seems to be feeling really good. Oh my god. No. He gave me a rad ball. Bad people. Bad people. Oh god, we need more paint. Guys, seriously, we need more paint. Like, we need a lot of paint. Like, and when I mean a lot of paint, I'm talking about a lot of paint. Like, a lot of paint. Okay, guys. Seriously, paint, please. Oh, thank you. You guys are legends. Okay, let, let, let's see what's going on. Let's. Uh, Byakuya should be on 10. Byakuya should be on 10. Byakuya should be on 10. What just fucking happened? It looks like he just won the lotto. Well? That, that, does this mean there's like a secret event or something? I hope that means that Byakuya's love meter will not drop. I'm calling it a love meter. Okay, let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. Let us see what happens. Here we are at the library. What the fuck? No. Hmm. Did I just max out Byakuya and nothing happened? Son of a bitch, if absolutely nothing happened, you do realize I'm just... Uh-oh. Oh, it's Monokuma Day. So today's the day, huh? I better review everything. Concept was Moe Monokuma. Can we make eight more paint? That is the question. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven... Oh my god, just made it. Just made it. This is Moe. It's got certain cuteness, I guess, but... But something about it is off. It's wrong. So do it over. It's a total failure. But you did technically finish your assignment, so... I guess I'll give you some more tickets. Eight trip tickets. So the next concept is... Right here. Monokumanolt. Oh god, no. I'm gonna give it everything I've got today so we can all get out of here together. You can't sleep your way out of this one, Sayaka. Sayaka seems to be feeling pretty good. And he's gonna give me another Spearow Bomb. Because you never know when you might be fighting Freezer. Okay, Monokuma, show me what happened. Byakuya is still on 10, so I'm guessing that's it until the end of the 50 days, right? So I'm guessing we gotta get Sakura-chan up. <laughs> well, I guess in that case we can date Mukuro and then get Sakura-chan up, right? And then we're gonna have Sakura-chan on 10, Byakuya on 10, and then we start doing 10 with don't get jealous! I know you're looking from far away. Look at that. It, oh wait, you can't see each other, can you? My god, the, 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 this positioning is just... 
Ah, this is funny. Oh my god, Toko's just, yeah, that's stalkerish. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and share with a friend. Uh, th th this is fun, this is fun. I wonder what the Danganronpa 2 version is going to look like. I'm scared, but I really want to see what happens at the end of the 52 days. So hopefully we can get all the characters. I I'm going to get the main ones down, don't worry, don't worry. Anyway, till next time, did you come out? Bye! Without warning, it began to descend. Deeper and deeper. Deeper, deeper, deeper still. Deeper and deeper, deeper and deeper. Deeper and deeper. Deeper and deeper it fell! Oh wow, I thought that was gonna go on forever. I closed my eyes, and sight fell away. All sound, too, disappeared. Too much emphasis on two. Alone in the universe, I waited for the elevator doors to open for the last time.